What's up guys? Today we are out on the hard water doing a review of Garmin's Echo Map UHD 93 SV Live Scope Plus bundle. This has got the LVS 34 transducer and we are out on the ice after uh, grayling and trout today. So let's get into it. Jigging jaw draggers warming up, catching up here. This is a better fish than I've been catching, I think. Ooh. Another jaw dragger. Oh, this is a big cutthroat. Oh, yeah. Look at the colors on this guy. Oh, man, he's a nice one. Beautiful. So this is the ice bundle from uh, Garmin for their live scope. It comes in a nice uh, carrying case. Everything fits inside of it. It's very mobile. It's, it's padded. Um, and then you can open it up and roll this cover back. Pick it up. And that stays out of the way. So this live scope bundle is composed of Several different parts. This is the Echo Map uh, 93SV from Garmin. That's the head unit. And that's what has all the different options inside of it. Uh, you can hook it to a regular transducer or you can hook it to a Panoptics uh, LiveScope transducer. And that's what we've got. We've got the uh, LVS 34. That's what we've got here. We've got that hooked to a Summit um, LiveScope stick. I do not like the transducer pole that they sell with this unit. It is a cumbersome thing. It's made up of plastic pole. You have to screw the sections together and adjust it. And it's, it's not easy to uh, set up and be mobile with. Uh, what I've got here is, uh, it's a summit life scope pole for the ice specifically. It's a telescoping pole. It makes so much more sense and so much easier. Um, so if you do buy this, I would definitely just throw away the uh, handle that comes with it and buy one the one from Summit. Inside here, there are options. Charts, sonar, active captain, different combo screens. But really what we're looking at today is the Panoptics live scope. Um, right now we are set for maximum 30 feet uh this direction so right now we're in forward scan so that means here is zero right below us and then we're looking forward whatever direction the head the uh, transducer is pointing and it's looking 30 feet in front of us at the moment and you can increase that here or you can set that to auto same thing over here this is the depth um, we're currently set at 15 feet max because this is a shallow lake where we're at right now and there's all sorts of information up in the corner. The grid system is very nice because um, it kind of lets you gauge distances and sizes of fish. Um, at this at this current setting, we're looking at about a two foot grid. Another part of this bundle, which is the real uh, magic of it all, is this GLS 10 Live Scope black box inside here. And that's what makes the live scope and panoptics work. If you don't have that combined with this head unit, the um, live scope will not work. So you won't be able to use the panoptics option inside there. Also inside here that you can't quite see is a big lithium battery. Runs forever. Got the cord, wraps all around the handle real nice. There's this extra carrying handle which comes with the bag. And then the, the real star is this LVS 34 transducer. And currently we are in what I said was forward mode. So you, you can see that it's tipped up. And with, with LiveScope, there's actually three beams 
that are being sent out from this transducer. And it's like one, two, and three. And so this is called forward mode. And like I showed you on the screen, when you're in forward mode, everything to the right is whatever direction this is pointing. So this direction, with this like this, this direction is forward. So the handle direction is lined up with the transducer direction. So you can tell exactly which direction you're looking on the screen. You can also change this to down mode. And what's cool about this, the head unit will sense um, which mode you're in based on the direction of this transducer. So if we change this one click forward so that it's more level. So now when you look at that screen, you can see the zero is now in the very center and it's looking straight down below you and to the sides. You can also turn the transducer sideways and that puts it in what's called perspective mode. Perspective mode is for very shallow water. All right, so uh, this is the panoptics mode and we're currently in 10 feet of water. Some tall weeds. Looks like about two feet to four feet of weeds. Again, right underneath us is right here. And we're looking this direction. This is where the handle's pointed. And as I move that, you can see that change. One thing you can see in this depth is these lines on the screen, the three cone angles going on. Yep, there he is. Two of them fighting over it. There goes. Oh, I missed it. Well, oh, he's on it. There he goes. That's a look at the live scope bundle from Garmin. Uh, this ice bundle is just a great tool. I can't wait to use it. I'm very impressed with the things I've done with it. I've also used it during the summer in my boat. And that's what's nice about it. I can take this wherever I go, whatever type of fishing I'm fishing. I can um, put it in a boat. I can carry it on the ice in a sled, whatever. So it's uh, very versatile and uh, it's a real game changer, especially for people like me. I'm I'm uh, fishing a lot of tournaments often and uh, can use every edge you can get. So uh, it's a really great scouting tool. And uh, like I said, I can't wait to use it. Hey guys, thanks for watching uh, my review of Garmin's LiveScope Ice Bundle. If you want to watch more videos like this, please click subscribe. And thanks for watching. We will see you next time. You fought a good fight, let you back in there. <laughs> that was fun, a double. Uh, now I'm all slimy. This fish are slimy. <laughs>